Good morning, Stephen and Anne, and happy Friday. We're in Portsmouth all morning talking to local people about the issues that matter to them. And just over uh, beyond those houses over this side, I can actually see the Spinnaker Tower and the historic dockyard. Lots of wonderful things to see in Portsmouth, including HMS Victory, which is the ship that Nelson died of. So if you haven't been to... Um, to Portsmouth before. It's a fantastic place to come and visit. So I think I'm going to knock on this door. This is number six um, and see who's behind the door. We're also going to be getting his opinions on the stories that we've been talking about on the programme this morning. Good morning. Good morning. You are live on TV and radio. Do you want to introduce yeah. yourself? I'm, I'm Richard. Yeah. How, how are we doing? We all right? Yeah, we're in? good. Thank you so much. We've got a lovely home here, Richard. Thank you very much. Very, Thank very you. nice. So what do you do as a living? I'm a painter and decorator. That, that explains yeah. the oh, lovely sorry. home then. I'll, I'll pop myself down as well. <laughs> so how long have you lived in Portsmouth for then? Oh, all well, my life. For, 41 years now. So, um, yeah, it's, it's, it's a nice city. It's lovely. Yeah. What do you like about Portsmouth? Uh, it's kind of like a very community-based city, if I'm honest. Everybody knows everybody. Um, yeah, it's a very friendly place. It's lovely. Um, yeah, really good. And really you're good. very friendly. You're a, a oh, I, like, I like to think you're so. A, <laughs> a pompy lad. Um, what do you do for fun then, Richard, outside of well, outside the job? Obviously, with with Portsmouth and, like I say, the very community-based city, um, they're into their football um, and the great uh, great supporters from Portsmouth Football Club. And that kind of made me make the decision to get into football myself. So I do. Uh, I run a football um, team or football club. Um, Hawks in the community over in Haven with my brother, um, so that's great for the community as well. So yeah, it's amazing all good. you've got the time. Yeah, yeah. To do that as well. Yeah. Can I just say as well, amazing location. You can literally see the Spinnaker Tower. Oh, 100 percent. Yeah, it's window. lovely. Like I say you really can. It's, it's beautiful. You can see all the sea, all the boats going in and out. The Spinnaker Tower is there. It's fantastic. It's a great spot. It really sure is. is. Well, I wanted to ask you about a couple of things that we've been talking about on yeah. the program this morning. I actually just picked up your local paper, which is called the News. The I've News. Got that right. That's right. The yeah. News. The News. Great yeah. name for a paper. Um, this is on page 11 on the News. It's City. Tory wants trust restored. So this is your MP, right. uh, Penny Morden. She is saying that she is throwing all of her support behind Boris Johnson. Yeah, she says, yeah. we need to get over the party gate sure scandal. Yeah. What do you think about that, Richard? I, can't, I kind of agree, actually. You know, um, the world, the whole, the whole world has been through a, a, the, the pandemic. It's been a horrible two years for everybody. Um, there's a, after all, there's a war going on now as well. And I just think it's time to kind of put this to bed, get, get the support behind our Prime Minister, let him deal with the issues that's going on in the world and move on, really. Mm, you know? mm, I'm sure there's many people um, that would agree with you. I also wanted to ask you about the rising cost of living, because yeah. as a painter decorator, that must be something that's oh, really impacting you. Obviously, fuel prices going high, sky high. Um, it's, it has a knock-on effect to everything with, obviously, the deliveries of the paint um, and everything else. Um, it really does have a knock-on effect. It, and, and to be honest, everything's on the rise now. It's, it's no, no surprise, really. Yeah, making yeah. it really difficult for lots of people. Well, Richard, thank you so much for having no us worries, in a lovely all. home. No really problem. great to chat to you, you this too. morning.